Researchers say eating disorders have skyrocketed during the pandemic. Medical reporter Liz Bonas shares how to find help. Hey there, everybody. Hello to you. The Eating Recovery Center in Cincinnati has a structured outpatient daily program, which helped one woman change her life. It got incredibly bad. I have, in the time that I really struggled with my eating disorder, that seven year window, I spent almost every day of a year in treatment. Um, so I've spent almost a year, over a year hospitalized when you add up all the hospitalizations and you add up all of the inpatient treatment that was needed, residential treatment. Um, it was a pretty severe disorder. Um, and just when we would make progress, something would set me back. Um, so it was definitely a struggle. So was there a trigger that sort of got you to that place? Just not being able to, to manage people's expectations, to fight stereotypes around race and gender, and um, to be able to just deal with emotions in a really healthy well, way. It's been uh, really bad lately. I think, um, you know, if you think about it, eating disorders are kind of a, an isolative, secretive type of disorder where there's a lot of shame, embarrassment, and guilt associated with it. So I think what happens is, is that with this pandemic, it gave an opportunity for people to isolate even more and not go in and see their providers on an outpatient basis, which then allowed the disorder to get even worse. So what kind of growth have you seen in all of these eating disorders? So if it's with anorexia and neurosa, you'll see, uh, you know, more weight loss. And uh, it's a little bit more obvious just because you can see the person becoming more emaciated and, and thin. Um, with uh, the bulimia neurosa, I think um, what you see is, is more hospitalizations due to, um, you know, like electrolyte imbalances or uh, low potassium or stuff like that. So if someone's watching this and they're struggling and you know that feeling, what would you share with them? I took up boxing in the uh, pandemic, and that helped me a lot move through some of the challenges of just the day-to-day -day work and life um, that had emerged. I think the other thing really that has kept me grounded is just my faith. And that may seem really simple to um, non-believers or even to believers, but it has anchored me. And you can call the Eating Recovery Center at 877-825-8584 for more information. And in most cases, that treatment is covered by your medical insurance plan. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. We'll throw it back to you.